G'day YouTubers, today in um, Red's Beer Reviews, I'll be reviewing James, uh, James Bogues Premium Lager. <clears throat> this was probably the first fancy beer I've ever drank. These never used to be twist off, so I actually one night took a big chunk out of my hand trying to open it open it with my hand. I was a bit surprised and um surprised one day when I bought a carton and now they're twisties. It was good. I actually probably had this even before this just before mine, Nathan bought it out. So yeah, uh, enough wobbling, waffling. Um, one finger ahead. Give it a, a sniff. Get a slight hot malt flavour. It's probably using. Uh, it doesn't say on here. It's weird. Um, other other breweries state what they use. All they say is their finest ingredients and they've been brewing on the Banks Desk River in Monsistan. Anyway. Right up, you get a um, hoppy, slightly, slightly bitter taste to it. It's not offensive in any way. It's um then you get like a slight sweet taste and then it's very smooth overall. Very clean, very crisp. You can have, definitely have a session on this, no problem whatsoever. <clears throat> the only gripe about it is it's like it's here, here in Lincoln, oh well here in South, I can't speak the whole of South Australia, but full price is usually about $55, $60 a carton. Oh how I wish for Dan Murphy's, they were selling it for $40 a carton last week. Top her up. <laughs> Maybe I need to give it a bit more vigorous pour, that's about well and truly two fingers ahead. We'll try this way. is in my opinion I've liked this and drunk this for ages always pick it up when it's on special um, I'll give this uh, it's not quite up the level of the pills no kettle so I'll give this Eight and a half out of ten. It's not going to blow your mind, but it is a very nice beer. 
you'll enjoy having a session on it. And if it was cheaper, I'd buy it all the time. <laughs> anyway, my cider is almost ready. I think it's a couple of days away. And I'll post the video up and see how it went, hopefully. It went well, and it's not like really sour. Or nice, but a bit I'm a bit worried because I didn't just follow the instructions. I um put a cup of sugar, brewer sugar in it, but they said that was all right. It would just bump up the alcohol percentage a couple percent, which is good because paying an arm and a leg for four percent. Apple and black currant cider is um, a load of shit. Anyway, keep on enjoying your beers and I'll catch you later. <laughs>